Hi, thanks for joining me on our email alerts tutorial. I'm Suzanne and today I'm going to take you through how to access your email alerts, how to set them up for users and roles, and we'll take you through some of the differences between the types of email notifications we have. This is a very popular feature and something I'm sure you'll want to use. So if you go to the main menu and drop down to the alerts function, you'll see the email alerts area. From here, you can configure all of your email alert notifications. You'll see on the left hand side, there are alerts defined by roles, users, and your client users. Then, you'll see the information on the alerts that you can set up for these roles, users, or your clients that are specific to what they receive. So let's first go through the immediate alerts. An immediate alert is sent out the minute that something occurs on your project. So, for example, I might want all the administrators on my account to receive an alert, so an email notification, to your email address associated with your user login when any of these activities occur. So I tick all of the above, or perhaps deselect those that you might not want to receive. Then click Save. Now, all users on my account who have an administrator role will receive an immediate email when a task has been changed, a plan has been changed, etc. when any of these activities occur. So obviously, this would generate a lot of email if you have many projects with lots of things occurring on them, so we always ask just to be mindful that you're sending a lot of emails but if you're an administrator and you want to know when any of these activities occur, absolutely set this up for yourself. On the far right are the regular email alert settings. You would use these to be notified on a regular basis about tasks on your projects. So you can see, I can select daily, weekly, or monthly, and I can choose whether I want to receive information on simply my tasks only or all tasks. Down below, you select the content of those emails. So, I might want to receive weekly updates on all tasks on the project that are due in seven days, as well as overdue tasks. If I save that as an administrator, I will get a weekly email for all tasks on my project that are coming up in the next week and those that are overdue. I might want to set up an alert for all my project managers, so I just go to the left, select Project Manager, and maybe I want them to get a daily email on all tasks that are overdue. I could select this and any other time sensitive information as well. If I was a project manager and had the correct security settings set by the administrator, I could come here to set alerts for my team members. I could give them a monthly email of their own tasks that are remaining and maybe the tasks completed. So they would get a monthly email showing them those tasks that they've completed and those that they have remaining. And of course, on the left hand side, as you will see, I could set these notifications by users or for my client users as well. There's a wide variety of ways you could use this notification area. You might want an individual user to receive an alert as soon as a new project discussion is added, and that might be the way that your team gets feedback on results during your project. Or you might want individuals to be alerted if they are assigned or reassigned to a task, or even if the planned start or finish dates have changed. So there are a lot of ways that you can use this area to keep your team up to date without the heavy burden of yourself emailing out to all the members of your project. Selecting on an individual user will also allow you to choose which projects they are notified on. And of course, if you had a particular group of people that you want to receive alerts for and they're not listed here, if you watch the tutorial on creating users, groups, and roles, you'll be able to see how to create a role, assign users to it, and then that would be reflected here on the left, available to select alerts for. 
You can also reply to alert emails to update your My Home feed. When a user receives an alert for a project being created, a task dis discussion, a new risk issue or change, a new expense, new timesheet entry, new document added, a new project discussion, or a new task, they can reply and it will look exactly like a comment on the My Home feed and will also include any attachments on the email. So we've discussed how you access your alerts from the main menu, how to set up immediate alerts for activities that occur instantly on your project, configuring your regular scheduled email notifications and setting those up by either the roles of your users or individual people on your team. If you have any questions or issues using the alerts, please contact us in the support team. Thanks, I hope you join me on our next video, Managing Your Users and Security.